Hello, and welcome to our Serenade video. In this video, we will go over creating letter templates. What creating letter templates does is allow you to create a stock message such as an email or Word document or other messages that you typically send out to a client or yourself. You can add tags to auto-populate information and add it onto any case or client profile. Let us log into the caseworker portal. In order to create a letter template, you must have access to the admin tools. Let us go to the admin tools by clicking on the settings icon on the top right and proceeding to click on administrative tools. You are now in the admin tools section. On a separate tab of your web browser, we recommend having your caseworker portal open as well. We will explain in a bit why this will be helpful. From inside the admin tools, on the top row, you will see letter templates. Click on it. If you have not created a letter template and wish to create a new one, click on Add Letter Template. You are now in the area to create a letter template. You will want to start off by giving your letter template a name to help you identify when selecting it. Here you will want to type out or copy and paste any message you wish to see in the letter template. Examples could be a welcome email you send to clients, a set of instructions you send via email, or other. You will come in here and compose the message, and have many options to format it, just how you would like to see the message when sending it out to the client or yourself. A few things to highlight when creating letter templates are adding images and adding tags. To add an image, you can click on the Add Image button. You will be asked to insert a URL to that image. It is important to note that rather than upload an image here, the software uses the URL of an image to put on the message. If you have a website, you will more than likely have a URL specific to that image that you can copy the image URL and paste onto this URL section. If you do not, you may consider finding a website that provides image URLs and plug it in here. Once you have plugged in the URL, you can give it an alternative text, and lastly, you can define the dimensions of the image. Once finished, you will click on OK, and the image is now saved onto the letter template. The next thing you can add are tags. Tags are extremely helpful in helping the software auto-populate information on letter templates. You can choose tags that point to the client profile and case profile such as names, phone numbers, case information, and much more. To add a tag, you can select the drop-down menu and scroll through the numerous options. Once finding a tag, click on it and add onto the letter template. Or, a much simpler way to add tags is to go to your caseworker tab that you have open. From inside the caseworker portal, go to the tools section to the left and select Tag Helper. This tag helper will help you search for tags. You have options of searching for client tags, case tags, current user, which is yourself, and other. On the search bar, if you type in something like first name, the software will locate all tags that include first name. If you wish to narrow information, you will see drop-down menus where you can select individual client as an example, and even specify by role that you have in the case. Once you add a tag, for this example, for the individual client's first name, you can click on the copy button to the left, and going back into the admin tools and into your letter template, paste the tag. By adding a tag onto this letter template and saving it, should we use this letter template anywhere that it is available, the software will populate the information from the client profile, making this message seem like you instantly typed it. You will go one by one adding tags where it applies. Once you finish creating your letter template, you will click on save. Once saving this letter template and creating others, you may ask yourself where can you select a letter template? First, anywhere where you send an email to the client, the software will allow you to select a letter template. This means if you send forms, invoices, or other, you can select a letter template. Next, you can also add letters onto any case, which is located on the document section of the case profile, specifically the letter section. The benefit of this is you can not only send it as an email, but you can also export as a PDF, Word document, and also be able to add it onto any document assembly, which combines all your documents inside a case into one PDF. Besides that, you can now create letter templates for reminders, case process step activities that involve sending emails, and more.
By creating letter templates, you are making it easier on yourself. Being able to pull up a letter template you created once and have it instantly gather the information needed to send out to a client or for yourself. This concludes our video on how to create a letter template.